I like what I do. I like what I do a lot, yeah. Yeah, actually I do. I do. Yeah, very much. On most days, I like what I do. For the most part, yeah, I like what I do. I like what I do some days, and I don't like what I do other days. Now. Oh, I always did. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah, I would say uh, if I gave a percentage, it was probably about 80, 90% is I really do enjoy uh, coming to work every day. Um, <laughs> I love what I do. Yeah, I, I love what I do. Um, I love it. You know, I do love what I do. I love what I do. I do what I used to run home from school to do for free. It's a little bipolar. Some days I love it, some days I hate it, but for the most part, you know, being able to work with uh, the companies I get to work with and, and develop uh, innovative solutions is, uh, is both rewarding and a lot of fun. I've been doing it since uh, 1985, and uh, I was 16 at the time, and uh, so it was before the gray, and uh, no, I love it. I think it's, uh, it's a great field to get into, and I, uh, I'm very fortunate. I mean, I, I look back on it, there's been a lot of thrills, a uh, lot of ups and downs, a lot of struggles, a lot of hard work, but a lot of fun working with some great people. I love media, all media, all aspects of it. I love um, making clients successful. I just love what I do. There's nothing like uh, doing what you want to do and not having it be being dictated to you, so yeah, I love it. I've always liked interaction with people and building relationships with people, and I think that's really should be an intrinsic component of what we do as, as um, partners with clients. You know, I wear a lot of different hats and I always try to find the next thing that I love to do. Like, I just don't really, and I've tried all those jobs I hate. I've done construction, I've like, you know, you know, repaired burnt down houses, I've done plumbing, I've done roofing, I've, you know, done all that horrible stuff that just makes you miserable and makes you sort of thankful that you uh, do what you do, you know. I tell this story and people think I'm bragging or that I'm, not being honest, I never had a job, never worked really. And then photography has never been a, anybody that tells you photography's work is foolish. You're taking pictures for God's sake. Work, work is when you lift something. If you lift things for a living, that's work. So I never worked, I've never worked. And I've always been uh, great, I'm very lucky, grateful for that because most people can't say that. If you think about it, um, you know, first of all, I don't have to pour concrete today. Uh, you know, I might tomorrow. You never know. A musician's life is always a bit of a roller coaster. But every day, uh, I, get to, I get to come in and make something out of the air. You know, nothing exists. I go to work, and I create something. And at the end of the day, I've got something to, to, to give to somebody or to play to somebody or to show to somebody or to sell to somebody that... Um, that lasts, and hopefully, uh, hopefully, um, uh, you know, uh, creates uh, an action. The advertising industry is an interesting blend of uh, of art and science. Uh, I'm a creative person, so I, I love the the artistic side of it. Um, and there's a lot of science around how to make advertising work for customers. And uh, I enjoy helping businesses and uh, and people do great things through advertising. I really do enjoy what I'm doing. It's not punching a time clock. There certainly are uh, roller coaster kinds of emotions that happen. I mean, when you uh, are told by a client that you know you're, they're no longer going to work with you, or if you have to let somebody go, um, either for cause or for economic reasons, those are days that um, you know are truly not enjoyable. So. But the pros far outweigh the cons, and uh, I can't imagine having done anything else as a career. I won't say that there aren't times when I'm incredibly frustrated with it and, and hate parts of it, uh, but absolutely love the work. This is really a people-oriented business, and uh, it really gives you an opportunity to meet a whole bunch of different types of people. And then also, um, it also gives you an opportunity to really uh, play in a lot of different industries and learn an awful lot about a lot of different things. The most difficult thing about being in communications is you can't necessarily always pick and choose the work that you work on. Um, some clients, whether it might be a good social cause, it might be a company that you really believe in, you really love what you do for them because you stand behind it. But as a professional communicator, we don't always have that choice of the work we do and who we do it for. So sometimes you have to kind of put your best foot forward for something you don't necessarily believe in the ideals of. There are certain things that come with the territory, and those things are difficult, and those things will always be there. There will always be budgets. There will always be deadlines. 
there will always be some degree of bad behavior. But, uh, you know, when one accepts that those things are ever-present, I think of it as like pickles at a delicatessen, it comes with.